Hi, this is Tom McMillan with the Lead One Bite of the Week. Two weeks ago, a senior officer of the NCAA stated that the NCAA would not accept integrity fees from sports betting, but would leave it to the individual schools to pursue them if they wanted. Integrity fees advanced by some of the professional leagues take a cut of the sports bets to pay for the oversight and compliance expenses that will be required for legalized betting. This is not a new concept. Pro leagues in both France and Australia receive such integrity fees. Because the United States is the only country in which big time sports is on college campuses, the risk of sports betting will be borne by our universities. And if there is a point shaving scandal, it will be catastrophic for our schools. In fact, all of the point shaving scandals involving players over the past 25 years have occurred at the college level. Now, it's also worth noting that more than 20 states in the United States earmark gambling revenues for institutions of higher education, including my own state of Maryland. This is accepted policy in the United States gambling revenues support higher education. Now, while I can fully appreciate the NCAA not wanting to deal with integrity fees, I would hope that they would strongly urge every state to earmark some of its sports revenue, the taxes they receive, for their higher education institutions. And these funds should be dedicated solely to the compliance expenses that our schools will incur. This will ensure that our universities will have the resources to deal with the risk of sports betting. Obviously, a national policy would make more sense, but in the meantime, the risk of leaving integrity fee decisions to each school is that the powerful gaming interests who have operated in many of these states for years will reap the benefits of gambling revenues while leaving the schools with all the risks, such as a point shaving scandal. To those who argue that legalized sports betting will be low risk, just look at the sport of tennis, which is facing serious integrity issues from match fixing, according to an independent report. We have heard the clarion call. Our universities will be taking enormous risks with sports betting and will need resources to protect themselves. That is our bite of the week.